Hey guys, we are back and we're going to do that last mission right here, Typhoon. Mobius have got themselves set up again since the Zerg chased them out of their old place. They say they've worked out where to find another artifact. Lovely little place called Typhoon. Oh, it's Typhoon. I don't know what it is. Okay. There she is, Planet Typhoon. <laughs> Don't look so bad. Yep, sensors indicate... Wait, what the... The star's energy output just jumped 500%. I've never seen anything like it. Slow down, Matt. What's it mean? It means the star will go Nova in a few hours. Meantime, the planet's getting bombarded by waves of fire. Fire. Why does it always have to be fire? Well, the good news is, we've got a significant cache of supplies planet side, so we shouldn't need to build supply depots. Well, that's something. So where's our artifact? Right there. Smack dab in the middle of all them Protoss. Our mobile structures can relocate and keep us just ahead of the fire, but we'll need to salvage everything we can't take with us. You wait seriously going down there. Come on, partner. We got hours till that sun explodes. Well, let's grab that artifact and get out of here before your Queen of Blades shows up looking for it. Fun times. It was you you get the banshees, which you know aren't bad, but um you know, there's another strategy which I'm gonna do, which is I find to be much more fun and rewarding. Remember Thor's? That's what we're going to be using. And then there are they are so much fun to use. Alright. Hi, Banshees. There we go. Hope you brought your sunscreen, cowboy. Now ain't the time, Swan. Relax, hotshot. I got something useful for you. Banshees. These babies can blow the snot out of ground forces. Got cloaking, too. Gotta love that. Roger that. Whoa, careful of those Protoss cannons. They can detect Banshees even when they're cloaked. There we go. And we just take out these dudes. We got like 300 energy with these. These are awesome. Oh, look, we're all done. We go this way a little bit. Nice job. Let's get our base up and running and get that artifact. All right. Move this guy over here. Get some things coming down. Unacceptable landing zone. Actually, you know what? You can you can stay on this thing for now. Okay, and we have one thing. Warning. Fire wave approaching. Yes, I know. Fire wave. Okay, anyways. It's nice because we can we can two shot these guys. You anticipated? Not these Taldarim guys again. They seriously need to learn when to quit. Okay. So they blew up their own son? Just just for shits and girls? You know, that's what I would do, actually. I'd blow up my own son. Alright. Banshees happen to be actually fairly effective in this case. Alright. I'm just gonna take out some of these guys. You know, people bitch at me for not using hotkeys. That's a super set. By the way, he gets a shout out. So he wanted he wanted a shout out, so he gets a shout out. Um, no one else gets shout out those. Starting now, only flubers can. Anyways, oh cool, go heal me. Uh, we're gonna keep these guys cloaked for now because I'm actually expecting an attack really soon. Keep the starport with us. I don't think we're gonna need it much more. Uh, we need an armory, and we will put it right there. Oh, we're good for now. May regret that, but you know. Ah, uh, I forgot about to get then getting the armory. And so with the armory, we just get you know a couple of buildings, a couple of fun things. Uh, you know, get everything going up. We just really want Thor's. That's all we really want. 
Oh, and we also want a new command center. Mineral field depleted. You might as well actually go bring them all the way down. Because having two command center, having two command centers mean you don't have to wait for this one to land constantly, which is kind of a pain in the Mineral ass. Mineral field depleted. Mineral field depleted. Hi guys, suicide, Terran as a Pardal, Sorry. Why do I call him Terran? All right, all done. Oh god, kill him! Out oh, Thor's. Here we go. Now the fun begins. Mineral field depleted. Mineral field depleted. Warning: Fire wave arrival is imminent. Base evacuation required. Oh, that's right. There's only one gas here. Tauri outpost to the east would make an excellent location to move our base to. We just need to clear them out and take possession. Yeah, we'll do that eventually. I, f I should have. I should have probably made that uh, thing a lot sooner. I kind of forgot to the the new orbital. Oh, you know what? Help and build it. Mineral field depleted. The fuck's the point? Okay, you guys all will go help build them. I don't think that's actually going to be necessary, but you know. Yeah. All right. All right, we got Thor's now. Our SCVs are under attack. Uh oh. So the Banshees are mainly going to be using for base defense. There you go. And we can go down here now. I'm not too concerned with this anymore. There we go. And where, where did all the SCVs stop? Oh cool. They're repairing stuff. And now we have two different orbitals. And we should also get the armor. I forgot about that. And I'll hockey these to zero. There you go. I'm using hotkeys now. Happy? Fucking flubers telling me to use hotkeys. Honestly, dude. Alright, I guess we'll bring all these units here as fodder to, down here. Yeah, good good for you. And I need to get Hell's Angels. You ready for war? Alright, hang out with hang out with that Thor. Mineral field depleted. We kinda need more Thors. Fuck. Get some more minerals. Jeez. You dicks. What do I pay you for? I don't pay you at all. And that's why. Alright, well, this is gonna be bringing all this crap around here. Wow, jeez. Well, I might as well just bring these guys up here. I had way more uh, the first time I did this. There we go. Now they're coming in. It's because that base got established kinda late. Is that how crazy these things are? They're Thor's, man. Alright, here we go. Use our ability. Cost like a hundred. Alright, let's go grab that. Oh, fuck. Oh, you can go take care of them. Uh oh. These are the one to counter the Thors. The one and only. Alright, uh, do we have more guys coming in? Yeah, after these two, I'm gonna, I'm gonna start moving them out. Alright, let's go. Come on. And the science vessels kind of help. They heal. This Taldoreen base is in a good spot for us. We just need to clear them out and take possession. Yeah, but if we if we had if we had uh, if we had the other guys, they would smell really bad. I don't think I'm gonna be able to do this one. No, I'm I'm not gonna count on that. Alright. Oh, you're not gonna be able to kill anything. Oh no, you're too busy being dead. Now watch this immortality protocol. He's just rebuilding himself right now, although he's blocking this entire thing right now. Kind of being a jerk. Oh, here you go. There's another one. And now he's back to life. So we basically don't lose any Thors. Alright. Take out that. Take out those. Oh, 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 you're dead? Oh, we'll just uh, bring you back to life. <laughs> why it's the coolest upgrade in the game. Although I don't think Kerrigan's attacks really do much for this. And get that one. Get these guys. Alright, let's start bringing these guys over. Oh, stupid guys. It's okay, don't worry about it. 
And we can just bring all these little things over here. There we go. Bring up with that. Oh, there's minerals there. Alright, there you go. And can we land this guy now? There we go. The Taldarine base has been cleared. She buys the well on her own. Our warrior's sacrifice was not in vain. We gladly march towards death to ensure your doom. You guys are kind of jerks. Why would you do that? Alright, bring these guys all over. Oh, and uh, let's make a bunch of guys come down here. Lift him up, and we're, c we're gonna continue going. Uh, I do need, though, another... another thingy. Um, Bob. There. You guys all help. And I need more of these thingy for bobs. Alright, you guys can keep going. Uh, I think it's over here. The next one. Oh look! Oh look, it didn't actually finish the upgrade. Or maybe it did. No, it didn't. Okay. And just tell him to rally to my good Thors here. My Thor shizzles. Pick up some gas. Oh, there's Archons. What? Just destroy them. God, do I have to do everything for you kids? Uh-oh. Uh, you guys should probably come over here. Oh, okay, I can just do this. I can actually hit my own building. No, I, it doesn't do friendly fire damage. So much for stunning, jeez. I guess it forgoes the stunning effect. Okay, and I got the, the other one there. Add some more Thors, keep going down. And keep it going. Oh, we can go land over here as well. And that's a great thing, Immortality Protocol only takes gas. So it's really not problematic, like, you know, I have the Science Hustles kind of healing, I guess. Except not really. But does it really matter? No, because they'll, they'll just revive themselves. I don't know, I find this to be much more fun and, and useful to do than Banshees. Banshees, you'd have a little bit of a tough time. But Thor's, man, Thor's just kill everything. Alright. There you go. Eh, half these guys can come over here. There we go, and just stun them again. Well, it doesn't stun them, but it does damage over a small area. It just stuns enemies, it doesn't stun it shit. Oh, I, I should start doing immortality protocol. Oh fuck, I don't have enough gas. Wow, that's new. <laughs> Thor's alive! He's so fucking cheap. Terranus Imba. Yeah, this is this stuff. Alright, take out this crap. Take out, take these banshees down here, because they like to rebuild. A lot. Alright, and we'll keep going. So many goddamn Thors. What are you gonna do, buddy? Oh, nothing. Exactly, that's what I thought. You think you can storm Banshees, but you're not storming these, these guys. No siree. Alright, we got the rest of these. Go lift this off. This is our final stand. Because if this doesn't work, then nothing will. Alright. I don't think we're really going to be having a problem here. Oh god, no, it got destroyed. Oh, more coming in. I just need to actually get some of these guys over there. They need to get up to the top here. Or else they're going to be blocking the entrances with their stupid corpses. And you know what the great thing about having immortality portal? Oh, these guys are getting damaged. Oh, let's just go kill them. Oh, okay. There we go. Okay, we're all done with that. Oh, never mind. It looks like uh, they killed them all the way. <laughs> Whoops. Whatever. How much, how much How much? health do they have when I've done this? Oh, wow. They actually take damage. Well, I learned something new every day. There, go kill those guys. 
And there goes the carrier. They're one and outlast and only hope of doing this. Alright. And more immortality protocol is required. Are under attack. And we can just go bring these guys all the way down here. Gotcha. There you go. And we can go lift all these off and we bring them all the way down. Not like I really need them anyways. Like I think we're I think we're done at this point. The stores are just so much rave. Ta-da! Hey, hey, hey. Final finale. Kaboom! There you go. Oh, it didn't quite go all the way. <laughs> it is your final artifact. Okay, the artifact secure. Saddle up, people. We're out of here. We will pursue you to the end of the universe, James Raynor. A thousand deaths cannot atone for your wanton sacrilege. And uh, without using a unit till the wall fire, I'm not sure if I did that. Uh, units lost. I don't know how many were lost to the wall fire. Maybe some marine or something, I don't know. Uh, kill 75. Oh, cloaked banshees. Damn. Well, we don't use cloaked banshees. We use Thors, and we're done. That's it. All the regular missions, but out of out of misery, out of our minds. Don't have to worry about it. Now it's on to other business, such as saving the universe and all that. Sir, we've reached the rendezvous coordinates. No contacts. Looks like the Mobius ship hasn't arrived yet. That's strange. It ain't like them to be late. Sir, Dominion ships warping in. Manx's flagship is leading them. Sweet mother of mercy. Sir, their shields are still down. I don't like this. Matt, pull us alongside and prep docking tubes. Commander, this is not a smart move. You wanted your revolution, kid. Now you got it. Turn around, Arcturus. I want you to see this coming. You won't find my father here, Commander. I am Valerian Mengsk, and I own the Mobius Foundation. Through them, I own you as well. Tell me why I shouldn't kill you right now. Because I can offer you what you've always wanted. A chance to rescue Sarah Kerrigan. Dun dun dun. The very rare times we actually do see loading screens. <sighs> That's a cool cutscene. That was fun. The artifact fragments you've been collecting are of Zelnaga origin. 
With them, I can construct a device that will reverse the infestation that transformed Kerrigan into the Queen of Blades. You're the only man who's been close to her and lived to tell the tale. You know her tactics, you know her strategies. And I know you'd risk anything for the chance to bring her back. Sir, tell me you're not seriously considering this deal with Valerian. Sounds like a golden deal to me, Jimmy. Kerrigan turns human, takes a bullet between the eyes. You can put your past to rest and still make one hell of a payday. Let's not get ahead of ourselves, Tigus. Assaulting Char is a suicide mission. You'd be putting all our lives on the line just to get your girlfriend back. This is bigger than all of us, Matt. It ain't about me. This is the only real chance we're ever gonna get, and I'm taking it. So which is it gonna be, Jimmy? We bringing Kerrigan back, or putting her in the ground? That's for me to decide. You both got a lot of prep work to do. Get to it! Huh. Alright, let's see news. This is Kate Lockwell for UNN. Tonight, top Dominion military analysts are still confused and relieved to report that while attacks do continue throughout the fringe, the main Zerg push into Dominion space seems to have slowed. That's wonderful news, Kate. Our boys have really taken the fight to the Zerg. Of course, Donnie. But there's also a sense that whatever the Zerg were after, they either got it or they've given up on it. We may never know. You heard it here first. All right. And we'll just go to mercenaries. What else do we have? Well, we got the dusk wings. Might as well. It's a lot of damage they do. Like a lot. And Spartan Company, sure, why not? We can get them both. You know, I, I've kind of been neglecting my mercenaries and I have a lot of credits at this point. Uh, what the hell is this? Ah. Uh, the uh, that I, I haven't really been paying attention up here. We already know what the rest of these are. All right, uh, to the lab. You have more Protoss artifacts. Technically, it's Valerian who's paying paying us for them. How do you feel about that? He's a sellout, sir. We're receiving a <laughs> transmission from the Bucephalus. Prince Valerian's holding on the communicator for you, sir. I have to question your objectivity on this alliance. It's obviously a trap. I got it covered, Matt. I'm asking you to trust me. We were starting to make real progress against Mengsk. If we go after the Queen of Blades, we're throwing that away. This is bigger than Mengsk. Matt, if we succeed on Char, we'll save billions of lives. Billions. Mengsk can wait. I didn't sign up for this. You signed up to follow my orders. If you can't do that anymore, then get the hell off my ship! Sir. Wow. Interesting. You sure about this? You gotta know Minsk is gunning for you. He'll hit you in a way you'll never see coming. I can handle Minsk, Tigus. Just watch your back, old buddy. That's all I'm asking. I said I can handle it. If you don't want to be a part of this, you can take your 30% and go. Wow. Ah, Commander Rayner. I thought we might discuss the expedition to Char. Now... This is a dangerous game you're playing, kid. What's your stake in all this? Jim, I really think we should... I can see why my father wants to kill you. I asked you a question. Everyone wonders if I will be as good an emperor as my father. But I want something more. To prove that I will be a better emperor and a better man. That shouldn't be hard. If I reform the worst mass murderer in history, make her human again, teamed with the famous outlaw Jim Rayner, that's all the proof I'll need. So I'm just a cog in your machine. If it gets you what you want, do you care? Guess I don't. Okay. I uh, guess armory. So, what's the problem, Swan? What's the problem? You only signed us up with our mortal enemies. Every one of these boys lost family or friends to Mengsk. We're gonna be sitting on a powder keg pretty soon. 
Can't you see that? It ain't up for discussion, Swan. I gotta do this. Huh. Up, oh, Banshee. There you go. Created by the Dominion military to terrorize, ter terrorize rebellious colonists. That's funny. That was literally its purpose. And Cloak Generator is one of the most uh, sophisticated pieces of equipment. When eventually shut down, uh, teams are deployed to recover the generator or destroy it. <laughs> Alright, well let's go to the armor console, just for a minute, and we're going to see the Banshees, and it's going to be... They can remain close for twice as long, which is obviously what I need since I have like 300 energy. Oh boy. Or we can have this one. This one's actually kind of cool, but you know we don't really need to actually get this. You know when they st all stand conveniently in a line, like that. Nah, I'm not gonna be using ban banshees that much. Trust me. Uh, I think I pretty much have all the upgrades I need. Maybe I'll get it for the last mission when I'm like, uh, nothing else to upgrade. But I think that's basically it. Um, so I guess we'll see you next time, and uh, have a good day. Bye.